Hey y'all, it's Kristen, and I'm going to try and do this video for Her Melinda because I love you, Her Melinda, and you told me that you were having a hard time doing the um, bubble paper. And there are videos um, on YouTube explaining this, but I'm going to I'm going to explain it, and I will link. I forgot to link the video that I uh, told you about in my last. I don't know. I was talking about bubble paper, I think, when I did my fairy journal. Anyway, I forgot to link the uh, video that I saw, the tutorial. So, I'll link it in this video, I promise. But anyway, I'm going to do this for her, Melinda, and whoever else wants to know how to do this. And hopefully, I won't make a fool of myself. But anyway, I um, this is what you do. What I did was, I, I had some styrofoam cups. I have it in this pan, because if you don't have something under when you're trying to do this you're just gonna make a mess but I had some styrofoam cups that I just cut down to about I don't know they look like this I'm gonna try to tilt it just a little bit so you can see how big they are they're not very tall okay I put one packet and probably you don't need a whole packet but um, I have a ton of Kool-Aid because her Melinda told me to go get a bunch of Kool-Aid so I did and I have a bunch, so I just put a whole packet of Kool-Aid in one of these, and then some bubbles. And I put the bubbles up. I probably put um, a fourth to a third of a cup of bubbles in one of these things. You don't need a whole lot because you're going to blow the bubbles, make them come up, you know, really tall, and then stick your paper on it. Okay. And in the other tutorial, it said something about putting Cairo syrup in there, but I didn't do any of that because I don't want it any stickier than it already is. So I started already doing it, and you have to you have to um, keep doing it over and over. It depends on how dark you want your paper, your color, you know, your bubble things on your paper. If you want it light, then one time is fine. This right here is just one time. I did pink, yellow, um, a blue, which I don't have the right blue because Hermelinda told me to get mixed berry, not the other kind I was using. I think it's uh, blue raspberry lemonade. It's not very, not very dark, so I have to get the mixed berry. And then um, I think this is lemon lime, but I only did this is only one time. Like I said, if you want it to get darker, you keep doing it. But I'm going to show you how I did it. Like I said, trying not to make a mess here. I'm not good at doing tutorials. And probably you're going to see my head a little bit. And the fact that I need to color my hair just a tad. But that's all right. Because I love her Melinda. I'm going to do this. All right. So what I did, I just mixed the Kool-Aid up really well. And probably I need, you know... A straw for each one but we're not gonna go to all that trouble I just mixed the kool-aid up really 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 good and really I need another see I got some that's all right it's okay we're just gonna keep going so here's my piece of paper I'm gonna kind of pull this over so maybe you won't see my head so much but I'm gonna hopefully keep it in camera so you can see me blow the bubbles up You have to kind of stick the straw straight down or the bubbles will not come up there. And then you just stick your paper on top. And I like to touch the paper to the cup because it makes rings. See? Did that? Please tell me that that was in camera because honestly I wasn't watching. We're going to do this again. Oh, let me get my straw. This time we're going to do yellow. Am I in camera here? All right, here we go. You have to kind of put, like I said, put your straw straight down or it doesn't work too well. Then you take your paper and just drop it on there. The bubbles pop and you get the ring. See? So, Hermelinda, probably you didn't have anything under your cups. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I'm going to turn it around here so I can do the green. And it's 
kind of time consuming. I mean, you have to really want some bubble paper to uh, do a whole bunch of this. That's why my fairy journal only had a couple of sheets. But you just keep doing that. I like to do just a couple of colors. Like, I really like blue and green together. So, I just, you know, pick your colors. And I don't have any purple right now or I'd be doing that too. Hang on, let me make sure I'm in camera. Okay, there you go. Shortest tutorial ever. So, Harmelinda, I hope that helped. And that's all, guys. Thank you so much for watching.